Hey guys and gals, I got another one for you today. Bad news, my laptop took a crap. So, I'm going to have to try to get videos up just through the replay system. Uh, and then use the Twitch platform. So really I just can't edit anything right now. Um, and also some of my sweet games that I had saved on the computer are gone. Uh, yeah, not very happy. And I know I just gave you an IS4 match, but this is a game that just happened today. Um, playing with hoops, or yesterday. Wait, no, I'm gonna upload it today. So it happened today, and I did get some sleep, so I won't be yawning in this video. Um, but yes, the reason I was yawning was because the computer was starting to slow down yesterday and it really took me like three hours to complete that video and there was a lot of editing that I had completed and then it would fail. Uh, yeah, so that took a long time yesterday and then when I went to work on a new video today, the computer didn't work at all. So gonna have to find a solution for that. I do have a desktop, but it's pretty ancient, so I'm gonna try to see if I can get something going there. Otherwise, I'll just do these for a little while, and if I don't upload every day, don't hold it against me, but I'm gonna try. Hopefully, we can find a solution to this quickly. I might just drop the laptop off at a computer store. Alright. <clears throat> So IS4 picking up with hoops. He's in his Kronwagen. I'm in my IS4. We're on Dragon Ridge Standard Battle. And this is where I consider the choke. Um, and I like to be patient from both sides. Right now we're looking at a 705. Distracts him there. Round into his lower plate. I probably don't need to be shooting heat here, um, but since they were both hull down, I decided to just put heat in to make sure I could pen them. Now this 705A is from the NFTG clan, so I assume he's a pretty good player. I think they're top 10 clan when you look at rankings anyways. Which doesn't always tell the whole story, but some clans do it for fun, some do it for stats. And I haven't really gotten that far into that world. Obviously, I'm in the MSC clan. We pretty much play socially. Alright, so we're taking it slow here. And I've switched to HE. Um, I just used my last HE shell on the 705A. I only carry two in this because the ammo runs tight. Um, but it's funny because sometimes when you have a heavy tank that will not give up weak points, um, just switch to HE. I did 40 damage the first shot and 60 damage the second shot, and now he's decided to move. So that's going to help me be able to reposition myself. So it's a little, little nugget for you. The heavy tank isn't exposing himself. Don't expose yourself to get shots. Just switch to HE, get some damage on him. Sometimes you'll just break modules and they'll be like, you know what, you can't sit here. All right, so we got the machine there, 705A, and then there's a Leopard 1. Now the 705A got hit, I think, by Artie, so he's gonna try to move. And I tried to hit him there. He comes down the hill. Get a shot into the machine. I'm looking for another shot into the side of the machine. Can I get it in? No. I think, yeah, I just clipped the edge of that house. Alright, so the 705A and the machine are pushing up together. So they're going to work together to try to get me. Yeah, I'll track the 705A as he's coming over. My track off. First one in. Bounce the second one. Hits me on the third. 
I pen the T10, and now I'm just gonna chase the machine. This has a little pack hopper. I have teammates down here that can help me staying up there. The 705A and the T10 was not the best choice, so that's why I decided to come down here. And now the 705A will just, just continues to use his armor, so it's a good use of armor, but he's really not getting his gun in the game, so that's his trade-off. And honestly, that's fine. Good player that just wants to throw his tank. The AMX-30 tried to get behind me. Let's see where he is right there. The burning wreck. He just let me know that that guy was coming. He just launched himself from the ridge. He cannot safely jump over this ledge. So then the 705A has had enough. He's going to drive in here all hard and quickly get destroyed. Good play, buddy. You played safe all game long until you're too irritated to do it anymore and then you just throw your tank. Almost two mediums and a arty left. Um, let's fast forward here. Once again, not too exciting. Uh, the IS-4 apparently is just not that fun to commentate on. I mean, maybe if it's like a city match and it's like a 1v3 showing off the armor or something. So I come over the hill, snapshot that medium tank after, oops, killed the bat chat. I take the Centurion 7-1 down. Now it's just a matter of looking for Artie. And where are they gonna find Artie at? There he is. He's actually going to take our AMX-30 before he dies. And then our 268 shuts him down. So our Sheridan kills himself or explodes because he didn't play. I don't know. I didn't catch where the Sheridan was at. Get to end game stats. Did 4,000 damage, 1,400 assisted, 1,600 blocked. Generally, I block more, but uh, it wasn't a straight up battle. When the IS-4 is below the enemy, um, it's really not that strong, so I couldn't take too much chance. Uh, I'd like to be either a little bit above them or flat ground. Got 11 pens out of our 13 direct hits, and that was a total of 15 shots. And then, let's see what Hoops did. Hoops blocked 1,700. Out of 18 shots fired, he hit 16, pen 10. Did 3,600 damage and 1,600 assisted, so nice game by him. And then we had an E100 on our team that trumped us both. He had a sweet game of 3,200 and 3,800 assisted. I don't know if he was tracking people or if he was just spotting people, maybe on the left side. I'm not sure. Also blocked 3,000 damage, but overall good game. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and hopefully I can get a computer soon so I can get back to my editor. Appreciate the support, guys. Later.